You can only eat one type of cuisine for the rest of your life. What are you picking? Oh wait. If your answer was Thai food, we can be besties. And my first order of business as your new best friend would be taking you out to one of my favorite off the strip restaurants in all of Las Vegas. I'll pick you up on the strip and in 20 minutes, you'll be in Thai food heaven. We're here at Natalia's secret kitchen. It's not so secret, but it is a new location. They've done a massive upgrade in terms of space. Not only is the inside a lot bigger, but this outdoor seating area can accommodate a lot more people. You still need a reservation, but now you're much more likely to get one. Tonight, I'm on a date with my fiance, and even though he's a meat eater and I'm a vegetarian, this place caters to both of us. Natalia's is a local gem for many reasons, but most importantly, one, their food is flavorful and delicious, two, it's reasonably priced, and three, their menu is extensive, so most likely you're gonna find something for everyone in your group. We started out with this light jasmine tea. I mean, come on, look how cute that tea kettle is. For all you vegetarians out there, these pot stickers are banging. I always order these as an appetizer. But if your group can only stand one vegetarian appetizer, get this spinach salad. The name is deceiving, it's not a salad. It's just fried spinach, but the sauce is a showstopper. You're gonna wanna keep that baby and pour it over everything you order. It is a crime to skip this one. Oh my God, that sauce is amazing. Service is fast here, so you're gonna get your dishes right away. Let's start with the veggie options. I ordered the drunken noodles. I'm a drunken noodles girl. I get it everywhere I go. And these were perfectly cooked. You can taste that pan fry. And if you guys wanna try it vegan, I believe you can just remove the egg. Next, I also got a tofu basil dish. This was a ton of tofu, like a giant pack of tofu covered in delicious sauce, bunch of rice. You're for sure gonna have leftovers after this one. On to some fish. Here we've got the shrimp penang curry. It's advertised as being kind of spicy, but depending on your tolerance level, you might want a little more of a kick. If that sounds like you, a little known secret here is that they make their chili oil from scratch. So you can ask for that on the side and put it on anything you want. Now let's bring it over to Jesse for the meat. We're going with the, with the pour over method. Yeah. Oh man, he's so pumped. Look at him. <laughs> Good? Mm-hmm. Yeah. How's that sauce? What is the sauce? I don't know, it's got a little kick to it, but these are like crispy on the outside and uh -huh. soft on the inside, it's nice. They serve generous portions here, but I hope you saved room for one of Nataya's mouth-watering desserts. We got the honey toast. It has a crispy outside, a soft fluffy center, and ice cream. What's not to love? Nataya's also has sister locations in Centennial Hills and further south in Summerlin. If you love Thai food, please don't skip this one. It is amazing. Next on the channel, I'm taking you on a secret hike that most locals don't even know about. It's got city views, it's got mountain views, and best of all, it's entirely free and only 20 minutes off the strip. Subscribe for more and take care till next time.